I remember uh, this particular lady who was a wife, was a mother, younger children. Her husband was very concerned that she had an alcohol problem. She comes into treatment saying that she doesn't have an alcohol problem, was in denial for practically the entire time that she uh, was definitely not an alcoholic, did not have an alcohol problem. One of her justifications for that was just on the practical level was I never have a hangover the next day and I'm always caring for my kids. And her kids were very important to her. And that was always that justification. I've, I always care for my kids. My kids have never lacked. I'm not an alcoholic because an alcoholic, well, wouldn't take care of the kids and, and kind of her, you know, rant. And the way that I've learned through the, this practical thing of asking, well, why do you think this? And what are you gonna do about it? And trying to find the, this kernel of something in her, it just wasn't going anywhere that she was totally convinced she was fine. Uh, her husband was totally convinced she was not. What I found out was that she was um, drinking a couple glasses of wine a night, large glasses of wine, but a couple a night. But she loved to bake. And she found out that some people don't realize vanilla extract has a high alcohol concentration. Now, when you put a few drops into your baking, that's harmless, worthless. Drink vanilla extract, gonna feel pretty good. That's what she learned. A little bit for the cake, a little bit for the cook, and that was her day. Now in her mind, I'm not an alcoholic because I only have a few glasses of wine. Now the fact that this extract is making me feel a little good, well that's not alcohol, that's vanilla extract. One day, and this was near the end of her treatment stay, and we still haven't made any progress, we're sitting in group, and I've pretty much taken the tact with her that, you know, I'm just gonna meet you where you are. You're not there yet. Your husband is, but you're not. There's not much I can do. We're just gonna keep doing what we're doing, and you're gonna go back home and try to figure out what happens from there. But we're in the middle of group, and somebody else is sharing in group. And she blurts out, interrupting the person sharing in group, I'm an alcoholic. I'm first amazed that, that this very meek housewife interrupts because <laughs> she's never done that. And I'm also amazed, like, wait, wait, where's this coming from? I mean, I've been waiting weeks to hear this phrase. What she came to the realization was, and we don't know where, I kept asking her, why did you figure this out now? What, where, she has no idea. And I'm also at the point where I don't care at this point why you realized it that moment but she got it and she said you know if i was drinking that vanilla extract all day and then having a couple glasses of wine and then going to bed at like one in the morning waking up at like six in the morning to get my kids ready for school and driving them to school you know why i didn't have hangovers i was never not drunk i was drunk 24 hours a day that's why i didn't have hangovers i'm an alcoholic <laughs> And it hit her. And then the, the next thought, her whole face changed and she got really, really even more serious than she was. She said, I drove my kids to school drunk. I endangered my kids every day. Remember for her, her kids were top. I would never do anything. That's why I wasn't an alcoholic. And now that second realization, I've been driving to school drunk every day. So sometimes, you know, things click for us. And I think what we have to realize is just be open every day to what can I learn. I don't know if it was something somebody was saying in group that made this click for her. I don't know if she was ruminating something and all of a sudden it clicked. She couldn't tell me, I couldn't figure it out. But as I say, I, I don't care what happened in that moment, it happened. And for that last few days that she had, she worked really hard to play catch up and she had a good game plan. And when she walked out of treatment, she was set to go and do what she needed to do, not to have any more wine or alcohol. She was not gonna bake with vanilla extract. She was all set. Uh, months later, I heard from the husband that she was still doing well.